Hi, welcome back. Uh, another uh, important session or tip actually. So it is uh, useful, especially relevant for logistics execution. So loading points in SAP SD and MM in real time. Okay. So my name is Jagdish Kumar. So you see some of examples in real time. So it can be your delivering point, like, you know, the place you're supposed to deliver the goods after that customer pick, okay? Customer point, it's directly, so reaching to customer plant or customer plant, uh, the location where actually he's requesting. Storage tanks, certain times, like, you know, it is at customer place only, but in factory, so like, you know, they will ask certain materials, you have to keep it after that, you know, project installation and work will start. This is specifically for, you know, manufacturing uh, relevant uh, industries actually. Okay. So if customer received certain material through tanker, so emptying the loading tanker actually. So these are the few examples, but uh, crane carrying on, you know, forklifting, a lot of things will be there to sum up this one. The point where you're unloading your goods it might be at customer place it might be at customer plant it might be at you know customer project location okay so let's try to check this one where exactly uh, we have to uh, like you know do this one okay before that let me show you so i'm um, you you Udemy instructor, you can see, you know, so the courses, the current recording also available. In this course, SAP SD sales and distribution in plain English, it is around 78 hours now. Okay, day by day it is increasing. So SAP SD rebates, if you have some doubts, you can confidently choose this course and try to learn. So certain projects, uh, rebates are very key. I got some calls uh, for consulting, but uh, I don't find time because, um, permanent employee so it is so unfortunate so you see this stock transfer or intercompany sales with full confidence you can learn this sap sd pricing concerts if you have doubts you can do that if you are not yet introduced to s4 you can choose this course this is in business partners it is very very important nowadays in interviews they are asking if you are from ecc background also better go through it i'm telling you i'm just transferring my knowledge Okay, this is the forum I have chosen because I don't know how to prepare my own website and all those things. Better utilize this opportunity. If you are really want to learn SAP SD from me, please come back to me. Okay, these are the set of courses. I'm providing the links uh, below of this video. So let's get into the SAP now quickly. Okay, so I can choose SAP here. Okay. One second, let me reshare my screen. Okay. So let's see this. Let me get into this customer for your idea. <clears throat> this is the customer I have created. Okay. This is the place where so like, you know, the loading point is supposed to get maintained. For example, Okay, as for our deck, what is the example we have taken? For example, if you take this, so delivery delivery point, let me mention this, this we have to maintain here. Okay. Delivery point, okay. So once you maintain delivery point and uh, without like, you know, when is supposed to be delivered, like, you know, so for your factory working days, non-working days will be there. That's why we should have to assign. This is the standard one. We can define a uh, calendar in scale. Probably I will show you uh, in uh, maybe another separate session. You have a receiving points and departments and goods receiving hours. We'll discuss in the coming videos. So don't miss the next video. I will show you where this uh, loading point data will be stored. So. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go back. You can save it. You can see this. If you want, whatever you want, you can write it and you can do it. You can see this. If you if you have more lo uh, loading points, like, you know, uh, maybe plant, location, delivery. So one, um, as per customer requirement, we have created. Suppose if I defaulted, by default, this is the loading point it will ask. Otherwise, you can able to choose it at the time of creating your sales order and delivery let's save this okay let's choose the factory calendar 
and save this. Let's try to check this, where exactly this data is available in my next video. Thank you very much. Have a great day. So if you are not yet subscribed, you can subscribe my channel. This is how you can help me out. So if you would like to enhance your knowledge, you better don't hesitate to join all my Udemy courses. I'm just providing my links. Thank you very much. More importantly, Jai Hind.